Hello everybody. Hi. Welcome to my channel. I have not posted in a very long time, but I figured it'd be fun to come back and post a get ready with us with yes. a friend. And in this video, we answer a bunch of questions about ourselves, each other. How we met. How we met, how Alabama is, a lot of things. So if you guys are interested, keep watching and don't forget to subscribe. Oh, like, oh my, ew. Let's begin. First, we are, we got asked our favorite drink and. Oh yeah. We, this is not like our favorite because we drink a lot of other things, but. Oh, so say our favorite. Well, this is a dirty martini that we are drinking right now. It is beautiful. Cheers. My nails in this are so ugly. Cheers. Cheers. Um, well, I guess I'll start with that. Yeah, our favorite drink. We drink fresh margaritas all the time. I would say mine's probably spicy. Spicy margarita. Yeah. Like homemade, we do lime juice, triple sec, water, what lime. else? Tequila, silver tequila, lime. So good. Okay, so we're just gonna get ready. We asked some questions on Instagram like a few weeks ago that we're gonna answer. Just putting on some pour filler right now and we're not going to show you the prop like every product we're using because it's going to take up too much time but we'll link it below okay. age and where we go to college so make sure you lean in so you're not 21 club we're both 21 and we go to the university of alabama for a little tide we love it yeah love it we wouldn't want to be at any other school we, so oh yeah so I guess we can kind of like include how we met in this one too. Yeah. Wait, we how like, oh, we met. I know how we met. Yeah. So we lived on the same floor in um, our dorm freshman year. Yes. We kind of like already followed each other, kind of knew of each other. Um, and then. I think I knew of you. I don't think you knew no, of me. No, I did. Me. I did know of you. I did. <laughs> I, I did. So. I did. Well, yeah. <laughs> we lived like down the hall from each other. Yes. And I don't know, we just started hanging out. We had like mutual older friends. Yeah. And that helped us to kind of do things together. We were in different sororities. That was one of our questions. I was a Kappa here. I'm dropped now. And she was a Phi Mu. But yes. we still hung out all the time. Yeah. We still did things together. Well, we got Essies. like close when we went through 21 days of prayer and fasting at our church and like really got to know each other like on a deeper level. And then we've just kind of been inseparable since. ever since oh i get this all the time favorite self tanner i just thought about it because i remember that was one um so no we don't do myself. tanning beds um we want to protect our skin for whenever we are older but macy's introduced me to a uh new self tan dripping gold dripping gold we i get it from pretty little thing and it's you know, it's a little cheaper than like the leading self tanners. I feel like at like Ulta. I love Big Big. I I would say that's probably my second favorite. So she's olivey. I'm not. So like the fake bake is too olivey for my skin. I look best with reds, like red based tanners. I which, see. I felt like that was red based on me though. Yeah, which it might have been for you, but for my skin, it was like green. Yeah, that's how Saint Tropez is for me. Uh, yeah, actually, that's how it is for everybody. And like Bondi, because yeah. that one's just crazy looking. Yeah, I don't like um, but yeah, dripping gold is the best right now. It's so dark and it just like, it fades really well. I feel like, because I hate whenever t Tanner like breaks up and looks like super patchy. And I feel like it doesn't do that as much, but also loving tan ultra dark is one of my favorites too. But also like dripping gold's like really like affordable, which yeah. is also why it's my favorite. The only thing that sucks about it is you can't get it in store. Ew, my lips look white. Like, I look I need to tan my neck because my tanner. So I normally have a darker foundation because, oh, I keep hitting my uvula. I mean, my Adam's apple <laughs> because I self tan, but right now I my tan's kind of fading. So I need to blend it down a little bit. Cute. Okay. Okay. What's our next question? Um, What are some things you do to stay in shape? Um, I, I don't, don't really do anything to stay in shape. I'm not in shape. That's the thing. I'm I, not in shape. I used to not do anything, but as I've gotten a little older, actually since January, I decided that I was going to start working out a lot. And I do the TikTok uh, famous 
3, 12, 30 um, sometimes. And then I do Chloe Ting videos and like fans and wait sometimes. But I try to work out at least three times a week just to try to make me feel better and like more productive. Yeah. And she's, I kind of eat bad. Like she's like probably why I've started to work out more just because I'll go with you and stuff. Yeah. And, like, we need to stop and drink. Yes, we do. I'm gonna um, finish blending my concealer. Yeah. I don't really work. I probably I need to, but. Um, we got one question that was about if we consider like our friendship genuine, and I would say the most genuine. Yes. What do you think? Of course. Super genuine, like. The best, the most genuine person. You are. No. No, you are. I think that you really are. That's so sweet. You we always have, we have, have a very it. healthy friendship. I think that was like the first thing like I noticed about you're very like genuine and like I'm kind of real. In, you know? I don't know if y'all know, but I'm an A on the Enneagram, so I'm I kind of say it how it is. And I'm not mean when I say it. It's just you're gonna know what I'm thinking at all times. I never you never have to question how I feel. Which I'm like the opposite. Allie's the opposite. So we balance each other. That's yeah. like the same with me and Jackson, my boyfriend. Uh, he's the same Enneagram as her and they're more peacemakers and you don't know as much about what, where their head's at. And I think that's why we work as friends because we just have a good balance. Well, I feel like also I like keep more to myself about like, like I feel like you can know when something's wrong yeah, yeah, with yeah. you. Oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it's not easy. Like if something's wrong hard. with me, everybody's gonna know about it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, my new, my new favorite contour trick is using the e.l.f. Hydrating Camo Concealer as contour. And I, it's in the shade Deep Cinnamon. I love this stuff. I just put a little bit on my hand and then sculpt my face. Yeah, I need to get that. Because I just, I have not gotten makeup in so long i always wait till like everything runs out and then I back when i was stuff. super into youtube i used to buy makeup all the time and then yeah so yeah, that's I'm, what i would spend my money like me most too on. and now i just kind of like use whatever well i've been I have. like more like natural yeah it's been like a look. 20 20 kind of got everybody more on the natural trend i feel like everybody was kind of like the light and glowy but still, you know, snatched. Okay, what's our I next look question? So scary. You do not look scary <laughs> at all. I don't really look like this. I don't. You do not look scary. I look really like sickly. Okay, next question. I need mm. to take a sip. I forgot to. I feel like some of them I'm, I've I don't skipped. Know, like, some of them. Yeah. One girl. Okay, I don't know if you guys know this, so I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. If you don't. Whenever you respond to our questions, we can see who says what. So, whenever we got a I, really good question, we said it, it was, "What do you want to know about us?" And they said nothing. LOL. That's I don't. Funny. I think I think that a lot of people don't realize that like you can see it's not an it's not anonymous. Like you can see what user asked what question. I feel like I probably used to think it was anonymous. Yeah, I mean, I I would. Okay, we're back. back I think the best hourglass. Um, finishing powder, setting powder, finishing powder. What's the difference? I can't even remember. Did you prime? Yeah. Okay, this is a good question. If we were deserted on an island, what two makeup products would we take with us? Okay, I have mine like right now. Yeah, I do too. My biggest thing, honestly, with makeup. If you do your full face of makeup and don't wear lipstick, I just think that you ruin the whole look. Lipstick, I could change, agree that. lipstick changes everything and makes you just look so much more put together. So I'd bring lipstick or lip gloss, one or the other. Yeah, I'd probably say lip liner. Yeah, okay. But then my lips would be like crusty with like lip liner on it. Like you would need some, okay, I'm thinking too deep into it. Probably just lip gloss then. Yeah, lip gloss and then I would say cream, bronzer, and lip gloss. I don't even need the mascara. I would say bronzer. I don't have enough eyelashes to care about that. No. Sometimes no, I'll just much. like, I hate looking like super pale and like washed out. And Same. so I'll sometimes just put on bronzers. Which we will be getting tanned by the sun, I guess, if we were on an island. 
Yeah, but still would probably bring that. Well, just anywhere, desert it anywhere. Just take two items. Starbucks, Starbucks order. order. I got this. Okay, I don't really know. I like a lot of things, but my current favorite, cause I don't like super sweet. Like I hate like super sweet sugary coffee. So my favorite right now is this ice cinnamon dolce latte with only one pump of cinnamon dolce syrup. And I think it's perfect. I like forgot, I I don't really go to Starbucks a lot, a lot cause I just, I think it's just overpriced. Let's have another cheers. Okay. Cheers to- Makeup. Yeah. Vanilla sweet cream cold brew. I can never remember the name. Oh yeah, I love that. Yeah, it's just a just a good one. My like homemade one. Excuse my disgusting hand. I I messed up my tan on it and I. It doesn't look bad. I hate it, but I just had to say. Mine came all the way off. I don't think this is normal, so don't judge me. Favorite TV shows. <gasps> oh my gosh. Well, I guess yeah, Yellowstone. Yellowstone. For sure. I haven't watched. Yet. I know you have to. It's my all time favorite. I think my all time favorite is Grey's Anatomy. But I love Prison Break, Vampire Diaries, um, Gossip Girl, of course. Yeah, I mean like Friends, yeah. Like haven't the... watched Friends either. What? We, we don't really watch the same things. And if you haven't watched Dexter, watch Dexter. I haven't watched that. Um, One of our questions we got was do we have, well, we, people know, a lot of people know I have a boyfriend, but we both have boyfriends and they're both named Jack Jackson. I'm J mine's Jackson. Hers is just Jack. So yeah. I call Jackson Jack. So it can get a little confusing. Skin care. Mine's really simple. Mine's not simple at all. Oh, okay. Well, all I do is um, use Clinique. It's like face wash. And I like, have used a lot of things, but that's just like what's been like best for my skin. Like my skin's really sensitive. Um, and then I moisturize with <laughs> Bonds moisturizer. <laughs> Is that it? That's it. Well. Um, I sometimes tone, rarely though. I just, my skin's so sensitive. So I just go with the bare minimum now. I used to do a lot more, but now I just can't. Like Mine is sensitive, but I use such good stuff that it's okay. Yeah, yours are like really nice products. But they're not expensive. They're share. all the ordinary. Like, well, so yeah, that's true. Basically, I use like all of the ordinary products. I use their, I use the CeraVe hydrating cleanser, and then I use um, the ordinary hyaluronic acid, uh, squalene oil, retinol. Squalene oil? Use, what is that? It's like for dry skin. It's like a really good oil. And my skin gets so dry. I I, I'll have to do like, like I'll do a story showing y'all my skincare cause it's really detailed and it's, it's, I'd rather go in detail at a different time when I'm not, when I can actually show you all the products. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What is Bama like? Um, our campus is stunning, like stunning. I love our campus, the quad, the trees, just like everything is beautiful. I don't really know, like, I what is either. Bama like? Um, I haven't really been anywhere else because, like, I don't know. I don't really know. I mean, Bama is just, I think it's fun, you know. It's sad, like, that with COVID and stuff. Things we, going on. Yeah, like, we couldn't go into anything that had to do with, like, Greek life, which sucks, you know. Like, no, tail, no tailgating this year. But, like, normally our tailgating is so fun game days are amazing yeah game days are the best i feel like mm -hmm. at bama too like there's so many different people that you have the chance to to connect with anybody yeah there's so many out-of-state people That's from true. up north and just like there's just there's a lot of people that you can you can click with like you can find your crowd for sure it might be scary because it's so big at first but you can for sure find your people i think yeah you definitely can there's a variety of people here. And, <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> I don't know. I need, to get, I need to go get my lip liner. I just am laughing. BRB, Healthy Palette, the best palette ever. I love that. I use so these pretty. two mixed. Okay. I'm putting my lip stuff on because I can't stand looking at it anymore. Um, you know what I just realized? Uh. So I've always noticed that when I sharpen my um 
you know, what, um, lip, liner? lip liners. They're like, it's so weird. And it like is such a weird shape. Then I noticed it was a pencil sharpener, not a lip liner oh sharpener. My gosh. And so it's been forming it like the shape of a pencil and like That's not hilarious. lip liner. So I've like, and it like, if I sharpen it, it goes down to like here. It sucks. That sucks. Majors, what are our majors? We are both in marketing. Which one did you do? This one and then like that kind of on top and in the, oh, okay. in the corner. Okay. Yes, yeah, so we're both in marketing. Marketing majors, my minor is entrepreneurship. entrepreneurship. So it's fun. Oh yeah, it's the same. Yeah. I recently just decided that I want to do that because you never know. I just might want to start my own business one day. Definitely want to start my own business one day, so. What business do you want to start, Macy? I want to have a clothing business. I don't want to have like a classic like boutique or anything, but I think something online that's super different and like trendy would be fun. Yeah. I think that you would be amazing at it. Well, thank you. Um, so it used to be like super, um, oh. You mess up? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Macy. I'm just gonna kind of rub it out like that. Perfect, okay. Okay, I look so, not good. I kind of do my makeup like super chill now. I used to be like super precise with my liner and stuff, but I got this from um, Makeup by Mario. So good. It's just like a brown liner and then this kind of flicks out your wing. I'll show you. Like I don't do a perfect wing at all anymore. I just flick it out and then use a Q-tip and clean it up. But this is basically what I do. Um. Okay, let's see. Did you drop your sorority? Yes, Macy did. I went inactive because of Corona. Um, See, like that was disgusting. Size. And then I just use this and like flick it out. And like, there you go. You got a smoky brown liner. That's oh, so wow. easy. Everyone, this is like user friendly, beginner friendly. You should get this. I used to go like to high school with this like full face you did yes oh, every day you're kidding me no with like wingtips like, do we know how, how did to, i wake do up we know how to insert pictures on here like for the video um i don't because if i can insert a picture and show you guys what i looked like when i went to school y'all are gonna die well i went to school with my hair wet every day <laughs> why wet because i showered and i didn't want to blow dry oh. it in the morning i did not care i went to a small private school and i did not care what anybody there For thought some reason about I me cared. i was like when you went to a big to school though, like i did not care what anyone thought about me in that school i knew everybody since fifth grade they were like oh. i would like wand curl my hair like what was i trying to do when we had to wear uniforms but we would like try to get around it and wear sweatpants like what? under our khaki skirts <gasps> Sweat sweatshirts. Wait, and you were wearing hair. sweatpants under your khaki shirt? Oh, I did not care. Anything that would keep me comfortable, I was like, That's scary. I'm oh, I'll what? show you a picture of me. No, I'll, be, I'll be very scared. Y'all look how pretty this is. This is also Make It by Mario. Oh, actually, this almost just fell out. I'm not even like paying attention to what <gasps> I'm doing right now. <laughs> Wait, you know, which is, is I have new? to say, yes, this is new, and it came in, and when I bought it, it was damaged. Oh my gosh, the whole thing just fell out. <gasps> Macy. Well, that really I don't know how to get it back up there either. I just okay. made the biggest mess. Plans ever. after college. Graduating before me. I am graduating early. So you're going to get your life you started before me, and probably just. Yeah. Um. So. My plan is to do real estate for a while. That's all I'm gonna say for now. Um, I, I don't know what <laughs> I'm gonna I bring her to on do. And do real estate. Um, well. possibly if I can't find a job. Get a roll. Let's go get another. Well, you're. I'm really slow. I'm really. These are just so scary to look at. Like, <laughs> oh my gosh. We're back. Oh. So. Allie's always said she wants to start a YouTube channel, but she has never done it and she's doing it now. So I will leave her tag. In no, the, I'm yes. gonna have like 13 subscribers and nobody's gonna watch. I feel like the thing is now is like 
everything has gone to TikTok now. Yeah, but I think if you keep your videos short, people will still watch YouTube. Like, they just don't want to watch, like, super long videos, you know? Yeah, that's true, but... Well, anyways, I'm leaving her ish in the, the link in the uh, description box. <laughs> yeah, but she's making one, and I'll put it in the description <laughs> box, and everybody needs to follow her. Oh, I wish I was, like, um, a buffalo wild wings right now. The same vibe with the buffalo wild wings. I don't like it. I mean, I think I've been there once, but like, I don't love wings. Oh my god. I love spice, and like, I feel like if you like spice, you love wings. Oh, so this is what I'm gonna do. Oh, didn't you tell me that you wanted me to do the buffalo wild wings challenge? Yes. Challenge? Yeah. I'm done, everybody. This is kind of like my going out or going to dinner. This is just kind of everything now. Everything. I mean, I kind of just wear it. Don't you think I just wear this kind of everywhere? What is this? Primer. Oh, well, no, I just try it. That up. Don't you think I kind of wear this look everywhere? Um. Yeah, but not always glitter on your lid. Yeah, true. True. Okay. You can catch. I know. I need to see if we have more um, mm. questions. Mm. We do. Favorite thing to do in your free time. <laughs> We, eat no eat and we like to make drinks like fun drinks like yeah we like true. to make like I, okay i think like our favorite thing probably ever is making a, a, a good fresh cocktail and sitting out in the sun on like a picnic like or make something guacamole. guacamole like we just like eating and drinking and hanging out yeah we're not like really we're Chilling. kind of like over the bar scene right now and we just kind of enjoy. I'm so over it. I don't know why. So, so over it. Oh no. She just dropped my eyeshadow palette, guys. I'm so sorry if I broke it. I'm already really sorry. I feel like it's... no. It's good. Well, yeah, because it's not like the Plotty ones. withstands breaks. It's, it's not. Fall. What were we talking about? Um. Uh, free time. Oh. Mm-hmm. Um. I've never mm. done my makeup on camera. I think this is the worst I've ever done my makeup in my whole life. It looks super good. I just glitched everywhere. I'm not used to this mascara. It looks good. I watch Honestly, shows. Honestly, I just like hanging out. Like my favorite thing about The Bachelor is just because I can watch it with friends. Like I just like talking to people. I hate being by myself. Not yeah. because I'm like, not because I can't be by myself or I'm scared to be by myself. I just, I just would prefer to be with people. I like love being alone. It's kind yeah. of scary how I like being. We're alone. very different. I like if I'm, oh, like, with a lot of people for a weekend or so. Like, I get, get so away. excited thinking about coming home to be alone. Macy has to bring me out to do things. I don't know why. I just don't. I'm just, a, I'm just really a social butterfly, but not even just like in what you would think of social butterfly, even just like, I want to be around one person. Just like, I don't like being alone. Like somebody. I get bored alone. I like, really? the thought of like sitting in my room watching a show by myself. Sounds horrible. Not horrible, but like so much more fun if someone's beside me and we're See, visiting. I'm pretty sure we got these at the same time, but my pencil sharpener <laughs> destroyed it. I don't want to use it that much because it's so dark. I love it. It's my fave. I need a little mirror. I like it, but it's just a little dark for me. Favorite uh, genre of song. That's a good one. Well, that's a really good one. Country. Country, for sure. But, like, we love everything. Like, we jam out to anything, I feel like. I like any kind of music. I Country mean... Country just feel good. Like, out in the sun, chilling with your friends. Like... Yeah. I would say country... Um... It depends on the depends on the on the vibe on the mood yeah what i'm doing where i'm going here's my in, in my car i only listen to country or christian music really big on christian music in the car it's like my place of like worship i feel like i love that okay so the next question <laughs> is if you could live anywhere where would it be in the united states so let's let's say in the united states i have to say tampa florida oh i would have to say Florida or Nashville or Atlanta. Nashville, like for sure. Like I actually might live there eventually, but I think like, I want to say in the South, um, Florida would definitely be my dream place for sure. Yeah. 
Florida, I, I would love to live there actually. Mm -hmm. I just want to be by some sort of water. Yeah, like... not not the cold. Okay, what is your biggest pet peeve? I wonder if you can answer mine right oh now. Oh my gosh. What is it? What's mine? Oh my gosh. I you know what? I'm a stickler. What is it? This is such a weird one. Macy cannot stand when it's mainly me who does it. No, it's anyone who does it. Yeah, but I do it like a lot. I've been catching myself. When you go to a restaurant, you're not allowed or, to no, say. Especially drive throughs is where it really, really ticks me at drive throughs You're not allowed to say. Can I have can the I? number two with a Coke or whatever? Can I? You can't say can I. No. You have to say, you, I would like. You are paying for it. You don't need to ask, can I? See, I just, I can't, I like, I don't know. You need to say, but you, you can still be just as polite and just be like, I would like a number one with no pickles, add cheese. And then be like, thank you so much. Like, it's just, and I only ask, can I, if I'm at a restaurant and I don't know if I can have that certain combination or like, you know what I mean? Like. I don't know if I can change out the vegetable for fries or something like that. And then I'll say, can I? But other than that, I'm like, I would like this. I know. That happens to me and I catch myself. I look at Macy. I'm like, Ooh. I know. It's because of my mom. <laughs> Sorry. My mom hates it too. And it Yeah, well, I, I just have never, like, I noticed mean, people doing that. Oh, my hair. I need I can to say my hair. I can say your pet peeve. Yeah, you can say I have a lot. Allie's biggest that I've ever noticed is interrupting people. I always get interrupted. Always. Well, even if it's not you, if someone else gets interrupted, you're like, she was talking because she hates it. I just think that I have a tendency to just jump in and be like, yes, say what I think, and then I'm like, oh, yes. Allie gets mad. She doesn't like. And that. then if some, like if let's say somebody say something and Macy interrupts them, I'll say, so what were you saying? She's like, so what were you saying about that? I'm like, I just hate feeling ignored. Yeah, and I'm, uh, it's not like, like intentionally not ignored, people are ignoring. Just like it's just like a. Yeah, not intentional. Yeah. It just happens. It's yeah. just a thing that everybody it's has. It's just one of the ticks that gets Allie just... I not. have a lot of other... So, this is this where we end. so fun. <laughs> we have to do this again if if you guys like it. Even if you don't like it, honestly, we're going to do it again because it was fun. Just chilling and doing our makeup just and chatting. answering questions. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> That was so weird. Bye, everybody. Have a great week. <laughs>